I come from an agriculture background, so I knew that I would I could write a story about it. Um, but I did. I thought I was gonna write about 4-H and what I do in 4-H, but a lot of kids do that. So I decided I was gonna think out of the box and go with um, branding day. I researched what the, what the shots were for, um, how the shots were um, used, what the what the shots right names were, that kind of stuff. I learned um, that if you work hard on stuff that you it, that it pays off. I was happy and I jumped up and said, "Yay!" It's ex it's important to students to learn about agriculture. Be like I said, because they need to know like where your beef comes from, or where your chicken comes from, or where I don't know your cheese comes from. Uh, to work really hard on it, and in the long shot, it might pay off. I think it's a great experience, and I'm definitely going to do it next year. I've had six state winners in the seven years that we've entered. Working really hard. We do, a, we do it all in class. I bring in guest speakers. We use the research sheets so the kids um, can find what they're interested in. We live in a very rural area, so agriculture surrounds us. And um, I've done it in seventh and eighth grade, and this is my third year in sixth grade. So. Um, we just do a whole month long thing and we do lots of edits. And so we're learning about the writing narratives as we do it. Well, I think it's, it's very authentic and um, that's what we're going for with Common Core. And so knowing why it's important and if you don't know, then research. We're kind of at the different angle because we do live in a small area. We have to say stuff that we take for granted why, why is this important that we know and that we can teach it? And so um, I just think it's a great way to get kids involved in what's real and what it takes to function as we do in our state. Oh, I would definitely encourage them. I've actually encouraged people I know to do it. I said it's a great experience for the kids. When the kids win and you, as um, Ag in the Classroom, you treat them like movie stars, they just go back to school and they're in awe. We usually have the winners do a PowerPoint so I could show it to the next year's class and that's kind of the bait for them. They like the, the way they're treated and, and um, how they get to go with their family and their teacher in a hotel, it's kind of a big deal. I'm impressed that so many levels of kids are being impacted by it, not just the kids who write the story, but the illustrators and the families. The families go away with, from here with a good experience.